Hey guys, so this video is going to be a review on the Revlon Colorstay makeup and I use the one for combination oily skin and I'm in the color 330 Natural Tan. Um, this foundation is amazing. This is one of my must-have foundations from the drugstore. I love it so much. It is comparable to my Max Pro Longwear which is fantastic because the price for Mac Pro Longwear is like 30 bucks, and the price range for this is between $9 and $13, which is fantastic. Um, I do have oily skin if you did not know that already, and this stuff is amazing. Where do I even begin? It holds up so well with my oily skin. Um, I can wear it for 9 hours and that's not even a joke, that's not an exaggeration. I wear it for 9 hours and I'm not even looking oily. This is amazing. It does give a matte finish which I do love, especially in the summertime. I do love to have that matte finish at times. Um, I do also look like looking glowy and dewy but I would prefer a matte finish and that's what this does. This is also a medium to full coverage foundation. You can definitely build it to a very full coverage. Um, I just put on one layer of foundation with my Sigma F80 brush and this is how it looks and I just love it. It is very flawless. It is not cakey looking at all. Um, it doesn't break me out. It's it's great in hot weather like I said. It doesn't start running off or anything. It just it stays where it's placed and I love that. Um, now on here it says it wears for up to 24 hours. I do not wear my foundations that long. I at most wear them for 10 hours, you know. Um, but it does, I believe that it would last for 24 hours. If not, if not 24, then, you know, more than 12 hours. And it also says it gives a flawless look and a lightweight feel. Now I have to say that it does give you a flawless look, but I don't agree with the lightweight feel. Um, you definitely, or me personally, I feel like when I do wear this, I do feel like I am wearing foundation, which I don't mind, um, feeling like that, but at times it does, you know, it does bother me. I do have my Revlon Whip Foundation, which I wear it and I don't feel like I'm wearing anything, and that is amazing, but this does, um, not really have a lightweight feel, so I don't really agree with that. Um, but everything else that it says that it does... I definitely agree with. It is an amazing foundation. If you have oily skin, definitely go try it because it is amazing. The shade variety is very wide and there's a lot of shades. And they also have, um, I think it's the normal to dry skin. So they have different shades for the combination oily and different shades for the uh, normal to dry. So it is great, a great um, variety in the shades. So that is amazing. Um, and if you if you were wondering, I wear Max NC35, and this is 330 Natural Tan, and it matches me perfectly. Um, so this is a great foundation, especially if you have oily skin. I do recommend it. It doesn't wear off. It it holds well in hot weather, and it's just amazing. It is well priced, and I definitely recommend it. Um, I hope you guys found this review helpful, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.